everyone, I'm Bill and this is my Airgun Range. I'm back at the range today. Today I'm going to be doing a video on how I set up my air rifles to shoot long range. Um, I'm going to be shooting the uh, Air Force Texans, the 257. Um, I'll be shooting 85 grain Botel slugs. Um, I don't know what the exact um, BC are for these slugs, so I'm going to show you guys how I figure out my BC. And uh, then we'll see if we can get out to 500 yards. Um, I just had some deer right in front of me here, or right at my tent here when I was out there setting some targets up. They're here every day. Where's the buck? All right, you guys going to have to get off my range. I'm going to start shooting here in a minute. And then when I was getting set up here, a buck came through. Um, he just likes to hang out at that 50 yard spinner, just staring at me there. Or the same buck that, um, that's been coming through here pretty regularly. But anyways, uh, so what I do first is uh, to get set up for long range shooting is I check my speeds. So I'm going to check my speeds real quick with my FX pocket chronograph. Um, I'll figure out what the speeds are and then I'll be right back. All right, so I got the speeds. We're doing uh, 1,010 feet per second with a spread of 10. Um, one thing to uh, take in consideration when, you, uh, when you're when you looking to do real long range, uh, a spread of 10 at 500 yards is 8.2 inches difference in elevation. So uh, the uh, that slug can be fluctuating up and down 8.2 inches with that kind of a spread. All right, so uh, the next thing I always do uh, is I get my um, ballistic app ready to go. Um, I don't know what the BC is in this uh, on this right now for these 85 grain slugs, so I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to make sure I'm still sighting at 100 yards. I'll take a shot at 100 yards, which I did sight in earlier at 100. Then I'm going to move right out to 300 yards. And on the Stralic Pro, the ballistic app I'm using, uh, there's a section there that you can figure out your BC. So what I'm going to do is uh, I just put a random BC as, uh, of 0.15. Uh, I know they're definitely going to be a higher BC than that. I'll take the shots at 300 yards, and I'll see how much the difference in the elevation is. And then I'll put that into the Stralic Pro, and that'll give me my proper BC and then we'll try to move it out to 500 yards to see if that BC is going to work. All right, so uh, let me get all set up here. Um, we'll get ready to shoot, and uh, I'll be right back. All right, we're ready to do 100 yards. We'll get the camera recording. I'll take an egg or try for an egg at 100 yards, and then we'll move it out to 300 yards. All right, here we go. All right, we're on zero, ready to go here. Let's see if we can get an egg at 100 yards. Where are you? There it is. Oh, I bounced it. All right. I was right there. Come on, egg. All right, egg is down. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to move out the 300 yards. Um, on the ballistic app, I'm using a, uh, the uh, ballistic coefficient of 0.15. So we'll do 300 yards. All right, that's going to be 11.9. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Point 9. All right, so I'm going to take a shot. I'm going to put my camera out to 300. Okay, we're recording at 300 yards. What I'm going to do is I'm going to shoot an egg. I'll shoot the one all the way to the right. Um, and what we'll do is uh, the um, I'll look at the elevation, and then I'm going to put it in the Stralac Pro to make a correction. So... Uh, we're at 11.9 mil. I'll take a shot here, and then we'll figure out how much higher or lower I am than the target. Uh, I'm not going to worry about left or right too much, but I should put in two for lift, uh, spin drift. All right, let's see what we got at 300 yards at the egg on the far left. And I know the BC is higher than this, so uh, I should be about a mil over the target. So let's take a look here. All right, let's zoom this in. All right, so I'm not expecting to hit it. I think I'm going to be about a mil high. Let's see here. All right, so that was a mil high, and it was a little bit to the right. So I'm going to do one more for spin drift. All right. So if I go to my Stralac Pro, I go to the ballistic part. Let me record this. Three, two, one. Okay, we're recording. All right, so on the... Uh, on the Stralac Pro, if you go to where it says BC, you can click on that. Now, uh, one mil difference would be, um, that's 11.9, would be 10.9. So I'll put in 10.9. Oh, let me delete, delete that. 10.9 mil. And then calculate. That'll give me a BC of 
0.21. So if I say you hit where it says use this BC. All right, so we got that BC of uh, 0 0.2, 0 0.21. We'll move it out to 500 yards. That'll be 25 mil over. Let's do 25 mil. Six, 12, 18, 24, 25. All right, and then we're gonna go another four to the left. Let's see what we got at 500 yards. Move the camera out. There we go. All right, so let's try to take a balloon out at 500 yards and see how close the BC is. All right, and then uh, then we'll make, if it were left to the right, we'll make a correction for that. Or we might have to make a correction up and down. Let's see how close we are. All right, I'll do the blue balloon. Oh, just above it. I'm even gonna aim right at it again. So don't forget, I was saying, so at 500 yards, I can have an elevation difference of eight inches with a 10 foot per second spread. So try the same, aim right at it again. Oh, just a little to the left of it. Okay, we're right there. A little bit of breeze, not much. All right, here we go. Got it? Okay, let's take the other balloon. Okay, here we go. Okay, the other balloon is gone. All right, let's see if we can get an egg at 500 yards now. Oh, I rolled it down the hill at 500 yards. <laughs> All right, let's try, uh, I got one more egg, come on. Obviously, it must've been pretty close. I'll have to look back at the camera, see how close I was, but. All right, we got one more egg there. We can do it, come on. All right, let's try for that other egg. Got it! <laughs> All right. All right, that's the first egg I got at 500 yards. So that's pretty cool. So that's pretty good. Uh, that was pretty lucky to get that egg. Um, with a spread of 10, like I said, that, was a, uh, that could have been an 8.2 inch difference in elevation. So it's just an average when you're when you're getting your uh, what do you call it the uh, the speed it was an average of one one thousand ten feet per second and so it could have been anywhere from you know a thousand feet per second to a thousand ten feet per second and uh, that could be an eight point two inch difference in elevation the other thing that um at five hundred yards that makes a huge difference if you're off by a couple yards um, you're not even going to be close to the target um, even I think even like a um, um, one yard. Is, is more than a couple inches in, uh, in elevation. So an egg, if you're, if you're um, you know, a yard off, you're gonna miss that egg. And the other thing that um, is really important is the BC. So you can see at, um, at 300 yards, that was, uh, what was it? We were a mil difference with the BC being a difference from uh, 1.5 to 2.1. So it makes a huge difference. So anyways, uh, it's starting to get gloomy here. The rain's coming here. I'm gonna get cleaned up and I'm gonna get out of here. But uh, I just kinda wanted to show you how I, uh, how I shoot these guns out to 500 yards. And uh, I guess that's gonna do it for today. But uh, <laughs> I was surprised to get an egg at 500 yards. So that was pretty good. All right, so until next time, bye-bye.